The suspect charged in the stabbing death of a USC professor was in a downtown LA courtroom today. Good evening, I'm Kaylee Heck. And I'm Rachel Ramos. Annenberg Media's Cole Sullivan was at today's hearing and is here to show us one strategy the defense is considering. That's right, Kaylee and Rachel. The possibility of raising a mental state defense means this pretrial phase we're in right now could last more than a year. What's happening today? David Jonathan Brown back in court today in downtown Los Angeles. The suspect in the stabbing death of USC professor Bosco Jean hesitated before agreeing to delay his next appearance. Uh, actually, I think I need that. His court-appointed public defender says he needs more time to look into the sanity of his client. Brown worked with Jean for three years in a neuroscience lab on campus before police say he stabbed him to death on the last day of classes in December. But if Brown's lawyer is thinking about an insanity defense, a USC law professor says that's a high burden to prove. Uh, you can be very mentally ill, very crazy, and not criminally insane. Ellen Sack is an expert of criminal law and a recipient of the MacArthur Foundation's Genius Award. She says there are three elements necessary to qualify for an insanity defense. Uh, the original version is called the McNaughton test, which you don't know the nature, quality, or wrongfulness of your act. Another possibility, arguing Brown isn't mentally capable of standing trial. Competency to stand trial has nothing to do with the act per se, but has to do whether you can um, consult your, with your lawyer with a reasonable degree of rational understanding. Arguing either defense is fairly unusual. Sachs says only 1% of cases even raise an insanity defense, let alone win it. Successful insanity, contested insanity, please, is infinitesimally small. Now, Brown did eventually agree to delay his court date. He's due back in front of a judge on March 21st. If he's convicted, he faces a maximum sentence of 26 years to life in prison.